I'm Joe Thompson with Certainty. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install base flashing on the inside corner of a power pit wall. I'll be using Flintlastic SA self-adhered membranes, but the detail steps are the same with any modified asphalt application method. First, when putting your field membrane in place, make relief cuts in all roofing layers to allow the membrane to take the shape of the corner. Starting with your anchor flashing or backer sheet, make relief cuts to accommodate the top edge downturn and the corner. For the downturn, make a straight cut perpendicular to the wall out. For the corner, make a straight cut parallel to the wall out. The sheet will now drop into place. At the bottom of the corner, the sheet will flex to indicate where the relief cuts are needed to accommodate the top and bottom of the cam. Mirror and repeat these steps on the adjacent wall. When applying your cap flashing, no cut is necessary on the top of the corner, but similar relief cuts are required at the bottom corner. Mirror those cuts on the adjacent wall. Flint bond, or another approved surface treatment, is required anywhere an overlap occurs onto a granulated surface. To ensure the bottom of the corner is watertight, affix one patch where the corner cut was made. Certainty does not dictate the shape of the corner patch. Not required for warranty, but if desired for aesthetics, broadcast certainty color matched granules into the wet resin. For more information, visit certainty.com slash commercial roofing for construction details or contact Certainty Commercial Roofing Technical Services.